Uh, let's show you the uh, latest pictures from Beirut uh, this afternoon. The latest chapter, it seems, latest instalment in that country's uh, recent story of misery. Um, according to some sources, not just one explosion, but two in the port area of the city. And some of the pictures that uh, you can see on, on elsewhere online show the most extraordinary uh, explosion spewing a huge mushroom cloud into the air. Uh, and scattering debris over a very substantial area as well. Um, one reportedly in the port, you can see presumably um, some extent of the, the scale of this explosion that's tossed cars some distance and overturned them, and presuming that's as a consequence of what's happened. Um, there's no clue at this stage, this very early stage, whether given that this happened in the port uh, area, whether it was these are live pictures you're looking at now, whether this was an industrial explosion, uh, always a possibility until confirmed otherwise, or uh, an act of uh, terror and a deliberate attempt uh, to kill and maim. Uh, it has been pointed out that this week uh, is the week in which the, an international tribunal returns a verdict into the killing of the former Prime Minister, uh, Rafiq Hariri, uh, with Hezbollah agents uh, thought to be in the frame. Uh, no confirmation yet as to whether there were two explosions, but uh, as those pictures uh, testified, terrifying, terrifying effect really, huge explosion in the port city. Our producer Zain Jafar, who was in the city for a little bit longer, uh, telling us that um, even his own flat uh, felt the damage there and items falling off the shelves, etc. And he's some distance from where this happened. So hoping to talk to him soon about what may be the background to events today in Beirut.